Hello, my fellow Bakugan Battle Brawlers, and yes, I do indeed have here a Bakugan Resurgence Booster Box from right here in Canada. Uh, I did get this booster box from Sam and Migo Toys. Uh, link in description below if you yourself want to get it. Uh, they are on sale for, at this moment, uh, recording this video April 19th, 2021. Uh, they are going for $17.99. Um each but with tax and every tax and shipping if you were to get one yourself uh they will round up to just under 30 dollars uh if you do buy them in bulk which i think you buy maybe four or five of them for about you would round it out around to around 100 dollars. you get like free shipping um which is a good deal in my opinion um i did only get one because i wasn't super sure as the listing itself is battle brawlers um but they do actually have all three sets resurgence Battle Brawlers and Age of Aurelis, and you do have to specify uh, which one you want. I didn't specify, so it was a luck of the draw for me, and I did get Resurgence here. Um, yeah, so without further ado, let's get right into it. Uh, I'm not entirely sure if this is going to be ENG or EFS, um, because this is the first time a Resurgence booster box has been found here in Canada. Uh, I hope, I'm pretty, I think it's going to be EFS, if I'm not mistaken, because, I don't know, we did get some, uh, yeah, it is EFS, that's good. Um, because, uh, when my locals, the upper hand, got, uh, a sneak peek, a little tournament event, uh, they were EFS packs, so, so yeah, alright, so first pack up here. Uh, Pyrus Hyper Mantinoid, Darkest Hyper Dragonoid Ultra, uh, Darkest Titan Cyndius, Chaos Hyper Hydrus, uh, Chaos Titan Crocilius Ultra, Chaos Titan Mantinoid, ooh, Diamond Gorthion for our first rare, Diamond Cubbo, alright, for our second rare, uh, then we have Aquas Hyper Mantinoid for our super rare, and then for our Hex, we have Second Strike. All right, uh, so I'll put Hex is there, Hyper is there, and then my rares in my common commons, I'm just going to put off to the side. I have diff two different piles going on. I'll do a recap of the Hexes and all the super awesome elite rares at the end of the video. All right, next pack. And as to save on making a mess, as to make my less mess minimal, I do put the booster pack in back to the blister pack and then back into the box just to save on uh, uh, waste space and everything. Uh, all right, we got Deep Dive, pretty good. Flame Wave, Tremor, Magma Shield, Pyrus Heat Shield, uh, Darkest Snare. Twisting Inferno for our first rare. Alright. Anger as a second rare. Uh, we have Shadow Dogs as a super rare. Uh, then we have ha uh, Hyper Trox, Aurelis Hyper Trox as a super rare hex. Alright. Uh, you there. You guys go there. Alright, next pack. Yeah, so obviously one of the chase cards in this set, I'm pretty sure, is Super Fuel. Uh, I do already have, I think I have one. I think I have, I know I have at least one Super Fuel already that I pulled from the sneak peek. I don't think I have two, but I might, I don't really remember. Um, but yeah, let me just bring the, bring this. I'm just sorry, I'm just adjusting the camera so it's easier for me to... Just open up packs here. All right. Aquas Serpent... Aquas Hyper Serpentees. Ooh, Diamond Web and Ultra. Hyper... Ventus Hyper Serpentees. Ruin. Ventus Maximus Scorthion. Diamond Pyrus Indius. Uh, we have Orlis Hyper Serpentees as our first rare. Ooh, China Riot as a second rare. 
Darkest Fortune as a super rare, not too bad. Search your deck for an evil card reveal and put on top of it and put it into your hand. Shuffle your deck. Pretty much one of the only search cards in this game. Uh, oh. And then, as I just got the regular version of it, uh, we now have a Hex Shadow Dogs super rare. That's pretty cool. All right, next booster pack. All right, so in this set, I think it's in this set. Uh, all I really want, other than Super Fuel, is the evolution for Gorthion. I'm pretty sure it's in this set. If it's not in Resurgence, no, I'm pretty sure it's in this one, the uh, Elite Gorthion. That's pretty much what I'm going for. Uh, just because when this did come out, I did run Gorthion on my team at the time. Like back in what, 2019, I had him on my team. Uh, my that, my team has changed since then. I've, I've been running HTN because that was pretty much all we had going for us here in Canada. Now I have much more options. So we have Aqua Splash, Claw Cutter, Dual Strike, Unstoppable, Flame Wave, Water to Ice, uh, Darkest Titan Serpentes as our first rare. Darkest Titan Mantinoise as our second rare. Uh, then we have Pegatrix Drill as a super rare. And then for Hex, we have Pyrus Hyper Pegatrix. Common. All right. Yeah, so I did run Gorthion for a little bit. Uh, just because, uh, depending how you can roll him, he did he could land on two Baku cores, which was pretty good. Um, he also had uh, nice stats, and then his Diamond Evolution was pretty good. Um... But now there's much better uh, Chaos Bakugan to use, such as Chaos Titanilius. I'm blanking on any other names because I haven't really paid too much attention um, for what's, you know, viable mainstream uh, in the game and everything. Uh, we have Web Snare, Pyrus Hyper Gorthion, Pyrus Hyper Fangs or Ultra, Const Constrictor? Constrictor, Deep Freeze, Aquas Hyper Tritonium. Ventus Titan Fangs or Ultra for first rare. Uh, Ventus Hyper Krakilios Ultra for our second rare. Uh, oh, then we got Ventus, or not Ventus, Aquas Hyper Krakilios Ultra for super rare. And for our Hex, Aquas Hyper Tritonium. Okay. Uh, so yeah, other than, someone let me know what are the, oh, yeah, the um, Pegatrix X Gilator Chaos Pyrus. Uh, that's a good Chaos Bakugan, Pyrus Bakugan to use. Um, cause that, cause it's base B power can get pretty, like first, like right off the bat, you're, uh, fu fusing it, and then, a, then you land on that, that fusion core, and then it'll get you pretty much up there, like 1400 B power, I think, base. Um, yeah, Tropic Blast. Aqua Splash. Dark Waters. This is a pretty good one. Uh, Claw Cutter. Solar Powered. Ash Cloud. Uh, then we have Darkest Titan Mantinoid as our first rare. We have Pyrus Hyper Trox Ultra as our second rare. We have Orless Titan Gorthion as our super rare. And then for Hex, we have Hyper Darkest Hyper Dragon Ultra. That's a pretty cool looking one with his, with the, uh, his purple wings. That's pretty cool. All right, next pack. Still no Elites yet, unfortunately. Uh, I'm not too worried about that. I have, um, I think one of the better Elites in the set is that Pyrus uh, Halcor. Uh, I do already have one of them. I can't remember if I have it as a hex. I think I have it as a hex. I'm not entirely sure on that. Because um, a while ago, the only way to really get Resurgence uh, booster packs in Canada is if you were to get the uh, three packs uh, that were available only on Amazon. And I think they still are. But they're like 25 to $30 if they're not on sale, uh, which that was a pain. I did do videos on those, so go check those out. Um... Yeah, Shatter Fist, Shadow Cloak, Thunderbolt, Divine Inspiration, Hyper Hydrus Ultra, Orlis as our first rare, Aquas Hyper Tritonium Ultra as our second rare. Oh, 
Hey, good. All right, first elite card, the one I wanted, Titan Gorthion Ultra. Uh, for six energy cost, base 1200 B power, base 4 damage. When you play this, destroy all other Evos. Uh, that was pretty much one of the really good... Uh, one of the really good reasons why I wanted this card, because it destroys your opponent's Evos. Uh, on top of each other, other character card through their own... When you play destroy all other Evos, move all Evos on top of each other character card to their own owner's discard pile. Yeah, this is kind of, um... Not like a Black Rose or anything. Kind of. But you, you get this out, you evolve him. Uh, when you play this, it's pretty much, you know, it just wipes the field of all evolu all evolutions, right? Uh, except for him, so that's that's something. Uh, so this is pretty much, if you if your opponent has a really good Evo, you're like HTN, you try to want to get rid of it, you play this guy, and then there you go. Uh, then for our Hex, uh, Hurricane Winds. That's actually a pretty, pretty interesting looking one there. Um... Although, one thing I'm noticing, uh, Hurricane Winds, three energy cost to do nothing. To do absolutely nothing for three energy. Someone, okay, that's that's odd. Uh, I don't know if this is a hex mistake itself. Uh, I'll, I'll have to go through my binder. Um, I gotta go through my binder later just to make sure, because I don't think I have this card already. But, um... Yeah, someone let me know what this effect does. I'll probably look it up myself later, but someone let me know what this effect does. And if they didn't even print an effect on it, or if it's just for the EFS hex version that doesn't have an effect. I'm hoping I do pull a regular um, uh, Hurricane Winds now, cause just so I can compare the two. So that's uh, this is a pretty cool, interesting uh, misprint. I will say that. Um, so moving on. Moving on. Uh, you know, I got the Evo I wanted. I got a misprint Hurricane Winds. I, I'm not sure what its effect uh, does to be to begin with. Um, but yeah, I don't I don't recommend running at the moment. Not this specific one because three energy to do absolutely nothing. Um, yeah, well, yeah. All right. Um, all right, so we got Pyrus, Diamond, Zindias, Pyrus, Hyper Dragon, Ultra, Aquas, Hyper Serpentes, Chaos, Titan, Mantinoid, Ruin, uh, Dual Strike, Diamond, Gorthion for our first rare, Diamond, Cubo, second rare, I see a pattern here, uh, Ventus, Maximus, Gorthion, Ultra, Super Rare, no awesome rares yet, that's kind of interesting. And then we have, our, for our Hex, we have Orlis, Hyper Serpentes. That is pretty interesting. I'm just lowering this because of my hand positions. Okay. <laughs> Alright, next booster pack. We are almost halfway through. We only have one elite so far. Hopefully we can get at least at least one more, maybe two. Um, it's not really anything specific. Because I know Battle Brawlers had an average of three to four uh, elites per box. No, no, I, our Battle Brawlers had an average of three to four elites per box. Um, depending. And the one Age of Orlis booster box I opened, that had five elites in it. Um, two, uh, two of them were doubles. Like, I had two doubles, two doubles, and then one elite, not a double, which is pretty interesting. Uh, this pack, a little bit dented on that, uh, Serpentes there, but that's alright. Uh, Aquas Hyper Serpentes. Ruin. Aquas Hyper Tritonium. Web Snare. Constrictor. Deep Freeze. Uh, for our first rare, we got Ventus Mirage. Twisting Inferno, second rare. Uh, oh, okay, good. Now, finally, get an awesomer of Divine Inspiration. And then for our Hex, Flash Flood. Okay, this may not look Hex at first, but if you look on the windshields of the cars there, and all the windows, those are the Hex. That's, a, that's an interesting Hex. I like that one. See, hexes like this are, like, what I like. Nothing that just makes the whole card hex. That's like, you know, okay. But this, this is, these are the cool ones. I find, like, only a little bit of his hex. Those are the, those are the cool ones I like. Um, let me know what type of hex you like. The ones where they make it only specific parts of the artwork are holographic. Or, you know, the whole thing. 
Uh, I like the ones that are, you know, specific. Sometimes the whole thing, that can be cool. But I do like it when they take the, a little extra step to make only specific ones to give it the holographicness just to make the card a little bit more extra special. Um, all right, next pack here. If we can stop this guy from falling over. Uh, all right, so second strike, common. Uh, whoop, pile's falling over there. Uh, Pyrus Hypergorthion, Pyrus Hypermantanoid, Aqua Splash. Darkest Hyper Dragon Adultra, Claw Cutter. Uh, for first rare, we got Darkest Hyper Pegatrix. For se second rare, we have uh, Darkest Hyper Nelius Ultra. Okay, all, all right. Shin Kazami for a super rare. This is actually a pretty good hero card. Uh, when you open a back on, you may draw a card. That's that's a pretty good one to have. And for our Hex, ooh, super rare Hex, Riptide. Unlike our previous Super Hair Hex, we got this one. Actually, does have text. What does he do? Uh, you must reroll your Bakugan. If you open on the reroll, that Bakugan has plus 500 B power, and you may draw two cards. Oh, heck yeah. That's a pretty good card. For four energy, that I'll take that. For for that effect, I'll take that for four energy cost. You got an extra five B power, and you draw two cards. I'll take that for four cost. That's pretty good. That's a pretty good four cost. Although, since it is a four cost, uh, you probably only want to run one of those in your deck if you do decide uh, to end up running that card. All right, so next booster pack here. All right, what do we have? What do we have? Uh, we have Ventus Hypermantinoid. Divine Inspiration, Energy Jaw, uh, Diamond Web of Maltra, Hyper Serpentis, Chaos Blessing. Uh, oh, for first rare, we have, how do I pronounce this? Oh, it's Karmic Balance, okay. Uh, second rare, Rock Riser, uh, one of the better uh, flip cards to run in a Ventus deck, or back on with the Ventus Bakugan, in my opinion, because it's, for one energy cost, stop a Bakugan holding Shield or Magic Shield, which are one of the, some of the more popular uh, cores that are being run. Uh, for super rare, we have Nature's Blessing. All right, and then for our Hex, we have uh, Chaos Hyper Dragonoid. Okay. All right, so this is what, our 12th booster pack now? So we are about halfway through on this one. Can we get another Hex, or can I get... Uh, like a regular copy of Hurricane Winds, so I actually know what it does. Alrighty. Uh, so Darkest Slicer, Mind Slip, Pyrus Hyper Pegatrix, Second Strike, Diamond Mantinoid, Diamond Web Meltra, China Ride as our first rare, Jenkins. Uh, this is. One of the best heroes to run, in my opinion, in a Pyrus using Bakugan deck. Uh, for Fury, at the end of the turn, if you have no cards in your hand, make a Pyrus attack for 2 damage. So if you have no cards in hand, uh, it's a free 2 damage right there. Oh, another Shun Kazami. Alright, I'll take that as a super rare. And then for a Hex, we have Pyrus Hypergorthion. Alright. Lucky number, <laughs> lucky number 13. Uh, can we get, ooh... That was that was something there. Uh, can we get a uh, super fuel, hex super fuel, or another elite card out of you? Let's uh, see. Let's go. All right. These are just keep them fall over, aren't they? All right. Let's let's take a look at this guy now. All right. So a tropic blast. Dark Waters, all right. Solar Powered, Ash Cloud, Aqua Splash, Freeze, Aqua Hypertrox Ultra for our first rare, Aqua Titanilius for our second rare, and then oh okay, I do already have this one already, but for our second elite we have Darkest Titan Plutonium Ultra. Uh, for 4 energy cost, base B power 1000, base damage 15. When you play this, you must discard your hand. Um, so this is good to run in a Fury deck. Um, 
So like I just said, with Jenkins there, no cards at hand, boom, two damage. So when you play this, discard your hand, make sure you already have Jenkins out on the field, obviously, in your hero zone. Um, so then, boom, extra two damage right there. So with that, fi plus that 15, if you're going for highest damage, high so play your highest damage wins, play this. You have to have a lot of energy on the field. Uh, so maybe you do want to have a, a Pyrus Darkest Ventus mix. Just to get uh, a little bit of tur Turbo Fury going on in there. Just for this. I just think that'll be a good, good thing overall. Uh, yeah, so moving on. Oh, for Hex, a Diamond Hex. These are always pretty nice to get. Is uh, Di Aquas Diamond Hydronoid Ultra. Rare Hex, too. That's pretty cool. Alright. I'm pretty much going for a Super Fuel at this moment. As... As, you know, I got more than one Elite. That's really all I really care for. I'm not really going any for any of the Elites in this uh, set. Uh, the only card really going for is that Super Fuel. Um, I know I already have one. I'm not, I don't remember if I already have two. Two of those cards. I can't remember. I have to check my binder uh, when I'm done with this. But, uh, but yeah. All right. Solar Powered. Darkest Slicer. Mind Slip. Ash Cloud, Second Strike, Ventus Shield. Uh, first rare, we have Orlis Maximus Trox Ultra that has no effect. That's kind of lame. Um, and but it's 15, but 7 cost. I don't think that's worth it. Um, Diamond Pegatrix Ultra Chaos for a second rare. And then we got Hyper Dragon Ultra, awesome rare. And for our Hex, Darkest Hyper... No, just... Yeah, Darkest Hyper Fangs are Ultra. As our hex rare. Next booster pack. Come on, can we get ourselves a super fuel? Alright, in the comments section down below, so list for me some of your favorite cards from this set or what cards from the set are actually good, uh, worth playing, and if I actually did end up pulling any money money cards from this set, because I'm not too sure myself. Uh, Alright, we have Claw Cutter, uh, Ventus Maximus Gorthion, Unstoppable, Water to Ice, Dark Path, I think that's the first time I've got this one of this video. Uh, Ventus Maximus Gorthion, ooh, Diamond Dragonoid Ultra Rare, alright. Uh, another diamond, Dan's diamond, uh, diamond sinuous ultra. Can we get a super fuel? No, but we will double up on the elite card of Titan Tertonium Ultra Darkest. All right. Uh, and then Hex Tertonium, uh, Ventus Hyper Tertonium Ultra Hex. All righty then. All right. Um, all right. Next up here, we are, we have what? Uh, eight more packs left after this. So we're, what, two-thirds of the way done? Now, can we please get ourselves a super fuel? Okay. Pyrus Hyper Gorthion. Pyrus Hyper Mantinoid. Ruin. Darkest Hyper Dragonoid Ultra. Aquas Hyper Tritonium, Darkest Titan Cindius. Uh, first rare is Lost at Sea. Twisting Inferno rare. Okay. Uh, Air Zero. Nah, eh, that's all right. Um, this is a pretty. This comes in the deck, so this is nothing really worth special. It's a pretty good card. Two hundred cost. Reveal the top card of your deck. If it is not a flip card, you may play it for free. That's actually pretty good. Two hundred free action card. Or hero card there, so that's actually pretty good to run. And then for Hex, we have Chaos Hyper Pegatrix Ultra. Alright, next booster pack. Can we please get a Super Fuel? Alright. Come on. Pyro Cyber Pegatrix, Diamond Mantinoid, Aqua Cyber Conservatives, Chaos Hyper Hydras, Ruin, uh, Aqua Cyber Tritonium, 
First wear is Orlis Hyper Serpentis, China Riot, Ventus Maximus Weapon Ultra. And for our Hex, we have Freeze. So what's going on in this? It's Maxator, it's Fade Ninja, uh, Freezing Maxator, that's what this is. All right. Next, Booster Pack. What do we have in this one? Can we finally please get a Super Fuel? Uh, I can't remember the rarity of our Super Fuel. I think it's a Super Rare. So it, it will be a little bit harder to get more so. Uh, Ventus Hyper Serpentis. Deep Freeze. Chaos Titan Krakilios. I'm just straightening up my pile of commons and rares I got going on here. Uh, a Tropic Blast. Dark Waters. All right. Sword Barrage. Pretty good uh, move in Shields of Destroy. Uh, for our first rare, we have Oralist Hyper Mantinoid. Second rare, Aguas Titanilius. Maximus Garganoid Ultra for an awesome rare. And then for a Hex, we have Water to Ice. Okay. Come on. you back in there and uh, just trying to get easy easy on the cleanup for later um all right we have constrictor deep freeze deep dive hey us titan mantinoid dual strike tremor hey we got emily all right First rare, Shargo Ronin, one of the best hero cards, in my opinion, to run, because it is a free plus 100 B power. Uh, one energy cost two, so that's actually pretty good. Uh, ooh, we got Strata. All right, heroes coming out of the wazoo. Uh, one of my favorite characters from the show itself, mainly because of who the voice actor is. Um, your hero cards cost two energy less to play, so that's pretty nice. Uh, for Hex, we have Darkest Titan Sindius. He has no effect. That is unfortunate. All right, last of the Maxitor packs. So five packs left, four after this one. Okay. All right, so it looks like what we have here is the regular version of the hex we just pulled. Darkest Titan Sindias. Darkest Slicer. Chaos Hyper Hydrus. Mind Slip. Chaos Titan Crocilius Ultra. Second Strike. Uh, Pyrus Diamond Dragon Ultra for first rare. Pyrus Diamond Sindias Ultra for our second rare. Darkest Maximus Gorthion Ultra. And then Hyper Pegatrix Pyrus for our Hex. Alrighty then. Four to go. Can we please get me a super fuel? Come on now. Ah. Ah. Come on. Come on out of there. All right. Dazzle. It's a funky name. Uh, Shield of the Faithful. Blaze, Sword Barrage, Shadow Cloak, Tropic Blast, Lost at Sea, Ventus Mirage for our, oh, second rare, uh, uh, Pyrus Hyper Serpentis as our super rare, and then Pegatrix Drill as a super rare hex, all right, all right, all right, third pack left. Can we get a super fuel or a hex I have for doubled up on? Or uh, elite rather, elite rather. All right, uh, Pyrus Hyper Mantinoid. 
Aquas Hyper Tritonium, Darkest Hyper Dragonoid Ultra, Web Snare, Darkest Titan Sandias, Chaos Hyper Hydras, uh, Diamond Hyd Aquas Hydrogen Ultra for our first rare, Aquas Diamond Serpentis Ultra for our second rare, Air Zero Super Rare. Ooh, Hex Emily. All right. This is one hero I do not have a Hex yet, and I'm pretty cool for it. Um, although it is a 6 energy cost, it has a pretty good effect. I'm going to open a Pyrus back on uh, attack for 2 damage. Uh, so, you know, you open a Pyrus, see if you reroll it a few times, that's just free 2 damage right there. Uh, so that's pretty good. Alright, second to last booster pack here. Can we please get a super fuel? That's all I want. Is just a super fuel. I'm fine with just getting one. I'm not asking for two, but I just want one. Come on. All right. Pyrus Diamond Cynthia. Second Strike. Hyper Dragonoid Ultra. Aqua Splash. Hyper Fangs Ultra. Pyrus Hyper Gorthion. Chaos Hyper Pegatrix Ultra. Uh, Ventus Hyper and Serpentis Ultra. Super Bear. And our hex is Mega Punch. All right. Last booster pack. Last booster pack. Can we please get a super fuel? Hex super fuel. Come on. <laughs> no, that's asking. That's asking for too much now. All right. Last booster pack. What are we going to get? Ventus Diamond Web Ultra, Ventus Hyper Serpentis, Aquas Hyper Serpentis, Ventus Maximus Gorthion, Ruin, Pyrus Diamond Cyndius. Our first rare is an Aquas Diamond Serpentis Ultra. Second rare is an Aquas Diamond Hydronoid. Ah. Pyrus Hyper Serpentis. How many of these have I pulled? Although it is a pretty good one. To, is it a pretty good um, Evo to get? Not gonna. I'm not going to lie. It may have bad stats, but when you read its effect, uh, base base one thousand be a power base one damage. When this opens, if it is holding a Flame Fist, make a Pyrus attack for five damage. So you have this when it opens and it's holding a Flame Fist, instant five. When you have your Emily out on the field, whenever the back gun opens, so that's what plus was it plus three, plus two, so that is in. Uh, it's basically if you reroll this with Emily on the field, that's like seven damage all day long. Uh, so it's pretty good in our hex. Spirit guide, common. Alrighty, um, so that is it for this booster box. Let me just get everything piled, organized together. Uh, let me look through my binder, see if I have a regular copy of this, because I'm not entirely sure. Uh, just to see. <laughs> um, just, yeah, if I do have another copy of this, it's probably going to be ENG. Um, but yeah, let me just sort, let me just organize my cards, have a recap out for you. And um, I'm not going to show, I'm not going to update my binder at the end of this video. As, uh, as I just don't really have the time for that right now. Um... But, uh, but yeah, let me just sort through these, organize them, then I'll have a recap for you in just a second. Yeah. All right, I put them in nice, neat piles, and, uh, yeah, these are all the cobs and rares. I'm not going to do a recap of those, because that'll take a while, uh, but I do have, let's do a short little recap of the, uh, uh, super awesome, awesome rares and the hexes that I did manage to pull. Uh, so we got Dark Fortune, Shadow Dogs, Divine Intervention, Pegatrix Drill, uh, got two Air Zeros, we have Nature's Blessing, uh, we got two Shun Kazamis, we got Strata, uh, Oralus Titan Gorthion, Aquas Hyper Kirkilios Ultra, Aquas Hyper Mantinoid, uh, Darkest Maximus Gorthion or Garganoid Ultra. We got two of those. 
And we also got two of the Elite Titan Tertonium Ultra. Uh, we did get one of my cards I did really want to pull from this set. Uh, we have Chaos Titan Gorthion Ultra. Uh, next, Pyrus Hyper Garganoid Ultra. Uh, then we got two of the Pyrus Hyper Serpentes. It's pretty good. Uh, then we got Ventus Hyper Serpentes Ultra. Maximus Gorthion Ultra. Ventus Maximus Web and Ultra. Okay, that was it for the awesome Super Rares and Elite Rares. Um, Alright, now moving on to this guy. Just to start off with the Hexes. Uh, the, my misprint hex, Hurricane Winds. Now we're going to say that the, the hex version itself is a misprint. Just the hex EFS version. Because, because, um, I went through my binder. I went through my binder. Uh, and I did find, I only had two other copies of Hurricane Winds. I had the ENG hex. Alright. And I had... The regular EFS version. Okay, let me just. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. So. So, let me just do this top down here. All right. So. The regular. Regular ENG hex. Hurricane Wayne's 300 cost action. Plus 300 B power, you can play an action card for free. No, you can play an action card that costs 400 or less for free. And that's what this EFS, EFS excuse me, version does. It's the same thing. Plus 300 B power, you can play an action card that costs 400 or less for free. Okay. Now, if you need to use the EFS English hex... You're just wasting three <laughs> three energy. Uh, I find that a pretty funny misprint. Uh, this is a pretty good example. Uh, just, you know, is it just this specific version? Yes, just this specific version. Uh, I can't say itself for the regular ENG Hurricane Winds because I don't have that one. But I have the ENG Hex and I have the regular EFS, which is basically, we take these, uh, we use polymerization, fuse them together, get this but oops something went wrong it has no effect um so yeah so i did get this nice misprint here um so this i will sleeve up later and keep in my binder for 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 pretty much forever i want to have it displayed in the front of my binder uh i would normally have it like behind this one uh but no i'm going to put it right in front of there uh so i do have that that's pretty funny uh, okay, moving on with our hexes. Um, we got Riptide, Water to Ice, Second Strike, Shadow Dogs, Spirit Guide, Mega Punch, Pegatrix Drill. We got Freeze. We got Flash Flood, a cool looking hex, and it's pretty much just the. Uh, the windshields there and uh windows oh, we got hex emily that's pretty nice uh or less diamond hydronoid ultra oh it's nice to get a diamond hex uh aquas hyper tertonium or less hyper serpentes or less hyper trots darkest hyper dragonoid ultra darkest hyper fangs ultra darkest titan cindius Chaos Hyper Dragonoid, Hyper Pegatrix Ultra, Pyrus Hyper Gorthion, and then we got what, two, two Pyrus Hyper Pegatrixes, uh, and Ventus Hyper Tritonium Ultra to end off our things for the hexes. Uh, so yeah, if you did indeed enjoy this here unboxing of the of a back gone resurgence booster box. Uh, please leave a like. If you live in Canada and you yourself want to get a booster box of Battle Brawlers Resurgence or Age of Orlis, uh, please check out the link in the description below as it'll direct you to um, this one specifically. Um, uh, just a booster box. The listing will say Battle Brawlers. Um, but once you go to your checkout, uh, you want to specify in the notes 
of which version you want. You can do that, or you can play the reload game, uh, which I did because I didn't really know there was a specify option. Uh, but to get Resurgence, uh, I was pretty lucky. That's the booster box I wanted. Uh, it is available at Sam and Miko Toys uh, here in Canada. I uh, don't know about you Americans. You've already had this set for two years now, so you've had your chance. Now it's our turn uh, to bask in the glory. Um, so yeah, if you enjoy this video, please leave a like, comment your thoughts on this down below. What do you think this card is worth? I don't know. I don't know how much regular, uh, regular versions of it is worth, but I find this pretty nice, pretty cool misprint. Uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like, comment your thoughts down below, share, like, subscribe, turn the bell on so you know when my next video is up. Till next time, my fellow Bakugan Battle Brawlers, just remember to stay safe, wash your hands, practice your rolls, have fun, keep on brawling. Till next time, sayonara.